Hey, I'm Skyler. Uh, if your iPhone camera is blurry, let's take a look at the actual physical devices. So I've got an iPhone 4 and an iPhone 5 here. And it looks to me like both of these are all right. What I'm looking for are scratches on the lens of the iPhone, which is uh, scratch resistant. If I'm correct, I believe it has a sapphire coating on it, the same that Leica uses in order to protect the back of their uh, camera screens. So look for any sort of obvious defect here. Scratches, uh, moisture, that's a really bad sign. Uh, dust, any of those things can cause the, f the camera to be blurry. The great thing is about the way Apple constructed both of these phones, however, these can be removed. So the back plate here on iPhone 4, this entire thing is removable and this part of it, this part of the lens, comes with it. So just by replacing the back plate, you actually replace what appears to be the, the, um, the lens. When It's not the optical elements, it's just a protective covering. But if you replace that, it would cost you $29 and it would fix the problem if the scratches were there or dust were there, especially because at an Apple store or any authorized service provider, they would clean it for you as well. Um, the same is true for iPhone 5. You'll see the glass here. That can be removed and replaced. So if your iPhone camera's blurry, check those things out. If you just got your iPhone though, if it's brand new and you went to take a picture and it's blurry, I know why. There's a protective film on the back. It's a piece of plastic and there's a little tab at the bottom here. Peel it off. <laughs> a lot of people leave it on there because they want to protect the phone from getting scratched. But when you go to take a picture for the first time, it doesn't look good. So take that off um, and you could consider a case or a zag invisible shield, something like that in order to protect the back of the phone. Thanks for watching. I'm Skylar.